Um, this is Pandora. Um, I noticed that she was spending a lot longer at the poo piles, um, which gave me an indication that she is in labour. Um, you'll notice the tail up, um, hunched over, uh, but not actually weeing or pooing. So a really clear sign um, that she's in labour. Um, she's also at 341 days of gestation. Um, after a few minutes, she moved to the shade area um, and she started looking at her backside. So, again, wide stance, trying to wee or poo, uh, tail up, uh, really good indications um, that she is in labour. What's happening now is she is um, actively pushing um, at certain points. You notice um, she is uh, pushing and still looking at her backside. There is a big push there. Um, and the other females, and they haven't really noticed that she's in labor yet. They're just around her grazing. Here now, um, her water has broken and uh, the other females are sniffing her and um, they've noticed something is happening. She's also pushing. We can see the nose of the Kriya coming out. Um, Pandora is annoyed at her friends, the other females that are sniffing her just because they're a bit too close to her and that's why she is spitting at them and making those sounds. She's just telling them, Give me some space, girls. At the moment, we can see the nose coming out and uh, the liquid that's draining from the Kriya's mouth. Um, the Kriya's breathing. So it's all looking very positive, very normal, um, all perfectly fine.
She is resting now because she has pushed the head out. Very normal for alpacas to take a rest. Here she's up again and the baby's head is out. This is a really important step. The baby will be draining the water from his lungs. And it's normal for him to be to be hanging there. Notice now that the front legs have come out, which is the next normal stage, and Pandora is having a rest. Uh, the females are just so curious. And what she's doing now, she is pushing. Um, so she is going to finish this labor lying down <laughs> by pushing the rest of the baby. This baby is very active, uh, all very positive signs. I checked his gender, so it's a boy, um, and I didn't really touch him that much. I'm just, I'm just letting her bond with her crea. Um, his airways were clear. Um, there was a bit of blood coming from his umbilical cord, which I uh, clamped, I, I disinfected first with spray and um, then I clamped, um, and there'll be a photo of that coming up later. The Korea will push, um, will sit down after that, you know, rolling, um, and then they will attempt to get up. Um, so these are all very positive. It's not taking this little boy too long um, to get up. And he's also putting his tongue out, which is that reflex for milk. Um, <laughs> Is um, upright, taking his first steps. 
you'll get better at this. Here's the umbilical cord that I clamped, just a close-up shot. And here's the little boy trying to find um, his mum's teats and trying to get that first drink of milk, which is really important. So I monitor this closely um, to make sure that he gets that important first drink. And there you go, after um, a few more minutes. Here's a photo of the placenta that she passed um, about an hour or two hours after the birth.